Hey, this is Teddy Burris, your LinkedIn trainer, coach. I'm all about helping people master LinkedIn as a business tool. One of my clients sent me an email and wanted to know if when LinkedIn shortens the URLs that they share under share and update, are the shortened URLs going to include all the tracking links? So rather than give her an answer, I thought I would test it and show you. So I've already gone and got a URL that I want to share as a LinkedIn update. And I want to show you how I'm going to share it, uh, which is a little bit different than what most people do that might get you even more value and still validate that the, the tracking links are in there. So I'm going to click share and update. Now I'm going to paste the URL, which is this big old long thing. And I don't want this stuff down below. So where it shows an image right here, I don't even know it has an image to show. There's no excerpt. Uh, so I'm going to get rid of that. Right here is hit the X. Hit the X. I'm going to go up top. I'm going to go get an image. Here's an image right here. I'm going to use this image. And so now, now if you notice, here's my excerpt. I'm going to type in um, something like click here to read more. And I'm going to do something a little bit artsy like that. There's my excerpt. There's my URL. There's the image. Now watch what happens when I happens when I hit share. Here's a really good story about why women still can't have it all. Click here to read more. And there's the image. So if you click on the image, it'll just bring the image up uh, out of LinkedIn's um, you know, slide share repository. There's the link, which is the comment on the image that I added. But if I click on this right here, actually I'm going to do right click open a new tab, which it would do anyway. And then as it's open, you'll see it can tell my hyper copy that control C go back over here. And you can see this right here is the exact same hyperlink as it was originally. So this shortened hyperlink um, that LinkedIn created or the shortened URL for this, when it resolves, it resolves exactly the same. So the bottom line is what it appears to me from this test is that if you use a hyperlink with tracking codes, when LinkedIn shortens it, it maintains all the tracking codes when it resolves or when you go to open it. So in summary, two things. One is if you're going to share a URL somewhere outside of LinkedIn, then consider using your own image. And don't let the URL resolve to the website with the image and the excerpt unless it's absolutely gorgeous stuff. It looks the way you want it to look. Number two is when LinkedIn uses its URL shortener. When that shortener resolves, it's going to resolve with all of the tracking codes that were originally included. I'm Teddy Burris, your LinkedIn trainer coach. I'm all about helping people master LinkedIn as a business tool. I hope this was helpful.